Good morning everyone. Welcome to another episode of The Hunt for Bronze. Today's episode is back out in the port. We're gonna, we're just gonna fish. I've got a good array of rods there, everything from jewfish, threadies, all the way through the brim, uh, snapper and whatever else I pull into. Um, my aim is to just go out and have a bit of fun today, get a bit of confidence back. The last two trips have been sapping and draining. Um, Brumba jumping off four toga hurt, and then out here on New Year's um, Eve and morning for a brim and a flathead and a pike was not the best way to start the year, but all good. We're gonna do it. We're gonna we're gonna have some fun. Um, I'm gonna throw some vibes around, some structure. Then gonna hit up some other spots and just gonna see what happens. We're just gonna try to enjoy ourselves and have a bit of a bits of session. So, on the chest we go. If you haven't done so already, please do like the video, subscribe to the channel. Uh, 2022's goals, we're going to three, 3K. 3,000 subscribers is our next mark. So, let's do it. Let's get it 3K by the end of the year. Appreciate y'all. Anyway, chest you go, and then we're gonna get to fishing. Woo! Now we're gonna push up right on the top of this bad boy. And we can just drift down and spot lock our way down. All right, so we're just fishing a bit of a reef. I've been here before, you saw me here on Christmas day get some snapper or brim or something, just something to have a bit of fun with. Like that. Holy crap. <laughs> That's good, whatever it is. Oh no. Oh, he's out, cool. This is why I'm fishing 16 pound litre. That's a good snapper. I'm pretty sure it's a snapper. Yeah, it's a snapper. It's a good one too. Nice fish. Ah. Yeah, good. Good. Good way to start the morning. Look at that. So, I think I have a little new addiction to these guys. Because, geez, they go hard. They go very, very hard. And he has absolutely engulfed that plastic. Look at that. Not bad for a little bit of river snapper um, on that new ACM as well. Four to eight pound, seven foot two bad boy. But there it is. Looks a good looking fish. He's um well in his 40s. Yeah, he's about 45 to the tip. Probably about 40 to the to the fork. How cool is that? Love that. And look at that, plastic's all the way down. He really wanted that. Shouldn't have asked a lot. Why I fish so heavy? Well, and such a long leader as well. Um, so I'm running about a 
two and a bit rod length leader. And because of where I'm fishing, it's quite rocky and reefy. So I'm fishing 16 pound leader. Um, you know, it's relatively heavy when you know there's brim in mind as well. But, I don't know, can you see that scuff there? But most importantly this, look at this. That is all scuffed up. So, I'm gonna go up and trim off on the first scuff mark and all right take two at this take two second cast on this spot oh oh another hit Couple of hits in there. Yep, definitely a couple of hits. Woohoo! I might have to put a new one of these on. That that fish absolutely destroyed it. Um, quarter ounce jigged for this sort of stuff. Um, don't quite need the heavy 3 8 of an ounce yet. We've got a bit of a bit of grace period with the tar current. There's a fish. <laughs> Just dunked him. Just dunked him. He's definitely not as big as that first one. Kind of winching him in. Definitely not as big as that first one. Because he's a brim. Uh, we got the old brim. It's actually not a bad brim either. Wouldn't say he's a great brim. Well, winched him in. Now, I did say this was a bit of a, a confidence session after my two donuts so I'm happy with whatever I catch so I've got these new gloves and it's just getting used to <laughs> holy dooly I was saying stuff about the new gloves but I'm not gonna because we're just gonna we're just gonna fish I got no idea what this is. It's a, probably a bigger snapper. <laughs> We're just gonna keep the rod tip up relatively high to keep him up and out of the structure. That first run was booming. <laughs> yeah, it's a good snapper. <laughs> That's another good one. Not as big as the last one, but jeez. I see why people like snapper fishing now on shallow reefs. Is he just not giving up, is he? He's rickrolling me, that's for sure. He's never gonna give you up. Ah, 
That's actually... I think that is better than that one. <laughs> oh. That is so much fun. That is a lot of fun. There we go. Another beautiful snapper who's again absolutely engulfed that plastic. That first run this guy did was absolutely booming. That's sick. There we go. Took a bit of time, but we finally got one. It's a brim. on that um, touchy shirt dutchy that uh, I'll get the packet out but new uh, Demiki lure in the market hey guys another episode of the hunt for runs done and dusted um, yeah a bit, a bit tough today um, Obviously we had that hot little bite period this morning where the damage was done by the Demiki Armashad and the flick tail. That thing there, great little bait on a quarter ounce head. Um, and the tail bitten off from a brim or something, but the Demiki. Um, give me one sec. I need to work out. Can't remember what the name of this is. That's bad of me. Touchy shard, these bad boys right here. Um, did the damage on that bigger brim I got this morning. Um, but that was it, like a flathead on the soft vibe, this tiny snapper on the soft vibe. Obviously, obviously just a slow time of year or slow period of time. Probably getting a lot of pressure too with um, all the holiday makers on the water. So might leave it alone for a bit. Um, oops, I dropped a bit. Might leave it alone and go do some other fishing. Um, my next trip should be a... I'm fairly sure my next trip's to Brumba Dam. So, going to chase toga and bass and see if we can do better than last time. I have an idea on what to do for toga now. Um, so, we'll give that a go. Um, I listened to Ramp Talk last time and kind of got away from just looking for fish. So when the old man and I go, we're going to go look for some fish and hopefully have a good time. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. I know there wasn't too much fish catching. Um, hopefully I've made it a bit shorter because of that. And don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned because there's going to be one to two uploads a week for the foreseeable future. So stick on that. Until next time, guys, go out fishing, enjoy yourselves, and I'm out.